in this tutorial we'll see how to read the crawl related data produced on crawling with nudge in eclipse so here we have two goals reading crawl db and reading all the segment data now as you can see when i open my project in my workspace and open the crawl related directory injector crawl db current part 00 and data it's in an unreadable format so i need uh, so i need to read it even this index it's in unreadable format so we need to take dump of all this data to make it readable in uh, like even this content is not readable for converting into human readable form we have specific java classes in nudge provided by the developers itself to read it and these are crawl db reader for the segment section we have segment reader so let us see how we can use them in eclipse now open your eclipse window here under run configurations first of all we'll read our crawl db so form a new java application by the name of read crawl db and here i've already formed it i'll just change the project name that is nudge 1.9 in my case the main class is crawl db reader the arguments are first argument is the input from uh, where the dump is to be formed and the second argument this one it defines actual uh, human readable directory where the output will be stored the vm arguments remain same simply run it now the dump has been created i'll show you data dump crawl db now see this is in human readable form this all defines the crawl datum that is the status of the url and here is the name so this file contains all the discovered urls and their status now let's create a dump for the segments so again go to run configurations here go to say i want to read the data for uh, formed by the fetcher operation that was content and crawl fetch so i'll define a new java application i have named it fetch read here project is nudge 1.9 the class is segment reader and here arguments so the arguments are you can give here any segment and see the first is the input here i'll change the name of this uh, segment name and second one is the output crawl dump segments fetch and here you will define what all part of the segment is not to be read so here i don't want to read the parse data parse text parse parse no generate no content so simply uh, crawl fetch data 
will be uh, dumped let's say i want to read the latest segment so i'll copy its name and run it we have got an error because by mistake I placed the wrong segment name because for this I have not uh, fetched the URLs from the internet I have just generated a fetch list so I will give another see I have just have crawl generated here so I will give this one as the name now so let's change it arguments and here change the name of the segment apply and run now so the dump has been formed it is crawl dump segments fetch dump as you can see it's now in human readable format similarly whatever part of segment you want to read just uh, give these form of arguments according to your need simply if you want to read all the data segment data don't give these arguments and if you want to selectively read it uh, define all others by hyphen no and the name of that uh, directory which you don't which you don't want to read so this way we can also crawl we can and then we can also understand what Nudge does internally. Thank you for watching.